Um, I'm here to tell you guys, I just don't know why you all feel entitled to me and my family's money and that however you feel, feel that way. But at the end of the day, it is gonna be what I say. But Kalani, for my children from money they send to me, that's their own duty. Kalani, you understand, your dad is from Samoa, where you are. You're supposed to help your family back home. There is Samoa culture that I understand, but I feel like this is being taken to the extreme. Just give me money, that's all I want. What money is he supposed to give you? Because if he's giving all of this money that he doesn't have, then he's going to be poor. He's not going to be poor. You guys live with your parents. They can support and help you. Either you're married or you're single. You support your mom and dad till we die. So that's how the way we raise. But I feel like Alani trying to change uh, us well from uh, the Samoan culture and telling him you'll not be able to help our parents. Or you, you, know, you can work to... So you can be able for both of you to help our family back home. So you want me to get a job and be away from my baby so that I can pay for people in a different country? I work full time. I take my kids to their activities. I take them to school. I pick them up. I take them to their games, their dance, this and that. Do you get it? Or you just don't want to be, you don't want to work. You're lazy, right? Oh. Wow. So I'm lazy because I don't want to work to give you guys free money? Not take care of us all. My mom wants us willing to help our family back home in Samoa. This is the problem because when you went to Samoa and you met us well, you must discuss how's your family, how's your mom, what they need now. When he was there, he agreed that when he came here, he needed to be responsible for his kids. You didn't talk to my family about that situation, girl. You got pregnant from my brother. Oh. You know, tell you to go get pregnant now. That is your own fault because you want to marry as well, you want as well to be your husband. And you will just, you just do it that way behind our back, like. It took two of us, it wasn't just me, we both got pregnant. I know, but you knew it. You knew about scared the situation would be at the end of it. This is just the craziest thing yet. I can't believe that they're accusing me of getting pregnant on purpose. As if Oswald well, is just this amazing catch when I've never asked anything of him. So it's just kind of weird for them to accuse me of things when they're the ones that keep asking me for money. Oh. I don't know what else to tell you guys at this point. You don't have Samoan and half Caucasian. Your dad's from Samoa. You should have that blood in you. You have that feel blood. that way. And that blood is in me is to tell people to like shove it when I feel like it. <laughs> I have not be because as well we will pay you what you say instead of mom. I'm sorry, Gladi. I don't care for the kids. Ouch. I want to take back my son to someone oh. to do his duty as before. Maybe you guys need to get divorced or separate. <laughs> you want him to not just leave me, you want him to abandon his kids. Because he won't give you all the money. Like, this is crazy. I want to take my son back. But I need to see that look be doing nothing. She wants to have us well for her husband doing everything. You brainwash us well. You're too old for him. You control him. All I've done is love us well. I don't like you. I don't care what anyone else thinks of me. He had nothing when we met, and I loved him. So I, I apologize for loving us well and having it have nothing to do with money. I really am so sorry. I can't. Why are you crying, Balani? Because of the way you brainwash and control us, will it? This whole circus, I'm done. I don't want to have anything to do with it. We're not I'm done. Oh, that's a threat. No one 